I don't want to talk about my life right now. <laughs> Ew, I don't like this lighting. Let your body move to the music. This is what I do with my life. Oh my god. Someone's at the door. Someone's at the door. Oh, I have friends. Hello? Hi. Hi friends! So today we are going to be doing a room tour of my dorm room. A lot of people were wondering what it looks like, what it's like living here, so today we are going to be doing that. So come on with me. So here's my mural at my bed. It's super cute. The lights are from Amazon. The gold little decals here are also from Amazon. So the lights are super cool because they're controlled by a little remote. And when you want to get weird, you can turn on the lights, if you know what I mean. No one knows what I mean, it's fine. So, fun fact, I painted that. Even though no one believes me, I did paint that. Shh, I wasn't supposed to put tacks in the wall, whoops. Dash me. And I just started drawing the horoscope constellations on here. Cause I'm one of those Vesco girls. <laughs> so I'm like super into constellations and stuff. Actually, I'm not. Hi friends. <laughs> this is my bed. Oh my God, it's scandalous. You know, it's pretty cute. It's pretty small. I feel like I have nothing to say about this stupid dorm room. I fucking hate living here. <laughs> this is my bed. Oh God, this is really revealing. She's from, I don't know where she's from. This is where all the thinking gets done, but nothing actually ever gets done here. <laughs> this is good lighting, damn. It's actually super comfy. My mom bought a mattress topper for the thing, so it doesn't feel like I'm sitting on like concrete, which is what this place is made out of. <laughs> It's a twin size bed. The sheets are from Ikea. This little topper blanket thing is from Tabitha Webb. Oh, thanks, B. And the two pillows here are from Winners. Super pink, super me, super fun, super fashion. After you move past the bed comes like the corner of the room and the corner just has the fridge and a fan. So the fan is from HomeSense and Winners, as well as this, this is super cute. I don't, I don't use this, but this is basically like a, a cloth. Everything I buy is from Homestead. This says, hello, darling. It's super cute. It's like, it's fake grass, but it honestly, it adds to the room. It's like a little bit of freshness here. I have a teapot and teacups here for people who come over that never actually come over. But in the case that anyone does, they're here. So these are from Ikea. Look how great this is. Why doesn't anyone come over? Like, what the fuck? It's fine, it's fine. At the center of the room when you walk in, there are five shelves. And yes, I realize that. It is friggin' March. Holy oh, shit, it's March. And there's still like autumn decor in here. I'm trying to move out here. So on the first shelf, I just have like school supplies. I have binders and notebooks. This is where I get all my awesome recipes for Campus Chef. I'm almost in the clear, but I'm not. Shout out to Miss Ludi for making us write all of those. And if you know, you know. Hours as we spent, they're just writing and writing and writing. I love that. Mm, hand cramps. <laughs> so here I have some autumn decor. I love autumn so much and I love celebrating it so freaking much that I just love to celebrate it in March. So it's just, it's still in here, you know, it happens. <laughs> so on the second shelf, I have candles, which are from Bath and Body Works. Smells like pumpkin spice and everything nice all the time because I'm a basic ass bitch. So on the third shelf here, I have basically everything pink that I love. I have like a calendar that shows the day, but it, this is definitely not the right day. It says January 1st. I was going through some heavy shit on January 1st. I need to fucking sort out my life, apparently. So I have a Pandora bag. I have rose lemonade, Bombay sapphire, which is filled with sand from Mexico. Oh my God, ew. I need to move the fuck out. I have a really cute little snow globe. One of the only photos that didn't make it onto the mood board. A big K. My pink mug. A bag from Aritzia. And then Lavash. This is my cow from Cancun. <laughs> and we called it Lavash because Lavash is cow in French. The correlation, I couldn't tell you. I really don't know. Lord, I can't explain what the fuck I was going through when I was 16. So on the fourth and fifth shelf, as you can see, there's just more like decor up there. I need to go strip my clothes off. I gotta go to a shoot, but there's not too much left left of this room tour besides the closet and the desk. <laughs> you don't even want to see the desk right now. <laughs> when I'm trying to shoot a room tour, but like my life is a mess. That's the tea. <laughs> Gotta go by! Six and a half hours later. Man, it's like I never left, but I'm back. Hello, hi, hi, friends. Like <laughs> anything changed besides the fact that I'm a little more covered up. Oh my god, scandalous. So after you walk in the door, you're greeted by this lovely big 
beige looking cabinet thing. It's actually huge, like, greetings. Welcome to my closet. Hi friends. Hello. Didn't see you there. This is what I do with my life, oh my god. So this is my closet. I'm literally sitting on the floor. Like this is what, what is going on. Okay, on the bottom level, we have my gym stuff here. Wear every morning, love that. I paid a hundred dollars for these, but they're so cute. They're so cute, come on, come on. Sometimes we need these things to get by in life to make us feel sane when we live in concrete jungles like this. I have my hunters in here because I go out in the rain so much, just kidding. I haven't worn those since I was in the first year of university. I have my laundry basket here. There's an easy bake oven here. No one needs to know yet. Then I have all my clothes. So up here we have my cheer shoes. We have some swimwear from Vitae Apparel and like other swim companies is where I keep that fun stuff. So as I cannot get up into the top, top shelf for you guys, literally it's just storage, but there is a whole lot of it. So right here is right beside the closet. This is kind of like where I get ready in the morning, I would say. Come on, Vogue. Let your body move to the music. Come on, Vogue. Let your body move to the sound. A lot of face skincare stuff. There's makeup, sunglasses, palettes kind of thing. So that's all right here. And it's kind of nice because it's right above like the mirror, but not gonna lie, like I need a stool. <laughs> oh, you look good today, bet. I need to stop by. I actually want to shower. Under where um, this like kind of like beauty section where I get ready, I have three drawers. So this is my intimate drawer. And by that, I mean this is where I have bras and things that I never really wear because I don't like wearing bras. Ew. I don't really like wearing clothes into bed. That's the day. This is my pant drawer. There's yoga pants, there's workout pants, there's jeans, and there's a whole lot of holes in them. So tell us, what happened here, ma'am? <laughs> I don't want to talk about a couple of summer nights. Oh. Um, there's some skirts, there's sweatpants, that's what's in here. Now I have to go clean my desk because that was the one part I didn't clean for you guys before you got here, so I need to go clean my desk. <laughs> Whoopsies. A few moments later. The last part of the room that I have been holding off to show you guys, which is honestly the greatest reason why I filmed this video is because I cleaned my room. I had to move literally everything that was on the desk to my bed because it was such a mess. <laughs> but this is where the mood board is. It's literally right above my desk, so I see it every day when I'm working. Just to remember and remind me that, you know what, I have goals and keep trucking and working towards them. Jesus, I need to shower. I like have to cover myself. It's too revealing. So that was my whole room tour. Thank you guys so much for watching comment like and subscribe if you want more videos like this kind of like campus living what it's like to be in university i would love to share and film those videos for you guys so just let me know in the comments below if you ever want to see those kinds of things bye